with his two meter frame, he would actually also fit into the back area. But at the left wing position, Jonas Kelman produced magic anyway in Sigurd. He was a top scorer against Kristianstad with eight goals. Sensational. Now he's showing us what he's capable of. What a match from the young Tunisian Vial Jalouz against Varda. He's playing handball from another planet and was the main reason for the Blaugrana win with his 12 goals. It was Kentin Mahé's game. The Frenchman scored from all over for Flensburg. The world champion seems to have finally settled in North and is in our best seven. A win in a big match against Kiel, and it wasn't Hansen or Karabatic who made the difference for Paris. Instead, it was Sergei Onofrienko. He was the X-factor against the Zebras with his seven goals. His side lost in the end, but 20-year-old Darko Djukic once again played his way into the limelight. Petter Overby put everything into the match against Kadetan and was the man leading the charge. His eight goals weren't quite enough to turn the match, but good enough for our best seven. It's atmospheres like this that push Titi Omoye on. At his old home, he made save after save and helped Paris to a deserved victory.